But right now, we want to talk about the 39th annual Jewish Food Fest. Ricky Schmitchell is here with us. Welcome. Thank Good you to have for you. having me back. And you brought goodies. I brought yes. lots of goodies. We have uh, homemade cheesecake. This is New York style chocolate. Um, we have a group of people, groups of people that get together and make all of our specialty dishes. We also have a silent auction with some really lovely beauty supply mm -hmm. products and a Prada handbag worth $475. Nice. And we also have our vintage shop with some high-end jewelry as usual and we have a bittersweet little thought going on about this. this is our 39th annual Jewish food festival and there's just a few core group of us that keep this thing going this big party that we put on yes. every year this could possibly be our last oh, so no. we would like to invite everyone to come yes. out th this next week November 9th and 10th mm -hmm. for some great Jewish food our silent auction um, we also have our pickles flown in from New, uh, Brooklyn Terminal nice yes <laughs> very so. very nice you guys thought of everything absolutely but, but it saddens us to hear that this could be the last we don't want anything no. to be the last one I know. Oh, we do the help like we do don't help. either but we our congregation is changing okay. and we still have just the same little group of people that put oh. this big party on every year and prepare all this great food it's still I mean we're not like going out of business for five years no. um, the kind of thing but this could be our last. Well, we need more people to step up. Yes. Right? We need, yes. we, we need help. We need all the help we can I, get. I've been eyeing this right here. What exactly is this? Because I'm about to take this. This is a babka. <laughs> a babka. Okay. And a lovely woman, Donna, makes all of these flavors. This is the cinnamon raisin walnut mm. one. I personally yes. love her chocolate I'm babka. Gonna, I'm going to take a little piece of this, and then I'm going to tell you how it is, Rudy. Yeah, you're going to tell me how it is there. Yes. Oh, there you my go. Oh, it's so good. Very good, huh? I'll share it I'll with take you. Just because yes, I'll do that. <laughs> and a cheesecake colleague. for everyone here. I want to I wanna talk to you about, about getting mm. the community involved. Mm -hmm. When we hear Jewish Food Fest, it's like, okay, do you have to be Jewish to go to this event? Uh, no, no. We, it's, we uh, rely on the non-Jewish community of Corpus Christi. They, they're a wonderful support to us every year. And um, we couldn't do it without them. Yes. This is a community yes. event for everyone to come yes. and enjoy. And it's one of those events where you get to know your neighbors. Absolutely. Right. I know. I get to see people that I, I don't see very often. They c come and wait in our line and the great food. And then um, some people I haven't seen for years and they, they just show up for our great food. I love these type of events because you, you're able to take your family uh, and celebrate each other's culture. Yes. You know, talk about, you know, their culture and then, you know, interact and of course you share with each other. And of course, there's nothing like bringing people together than delicious food. That's right. <laughs> that's that's right. what brings people together, and that's why you brought these amazing dishes, and you, you'll be able to get all these dishes there at the Jewish Food Festival. We hope that and pray that it's not the last one. Hopefully, you'll so be back too. next Thank year. Thank you. Yes. This is where we get our community involved. Now, yeah. let's talk about the location, where we go, what time, what days. It's at 4402 Saratoga. That's right in between Weber and Ever, or I'm sorry, yeah, Weber and Everhart, mm -hmm. and Congregation Beth Israel, November 9th on Saturday night um, is from 5 to 9, Sunday 11 to 2. Our silent auction closes at 2, mm -hmm. and we have our vintage. We also have a sweet shop where all of our congregants come together and make wonderful Jewish sweets and an assortment of, of delicious sweets. Absolutely, and those pickles being flown oh, in from Brooklyn. Oh, those yes. pickles Goodness, from can't, Brooklyn. Can't I remember one year you brought uh, the uh, New York uh, Black and white cookies. Yes. Remember Ooh, that? Yes. I forgot. Yes. I forgot. Yes. I forgot. Yes. Gotta have my black and white cookies. Those are on the so way excited. to you. Those oh. are on the train. Very good. <laughs> waiting, waiting to get hands on those. Yes. Very good. Well, Ricky, excited. thank you so much for coming thank in to you. share with us. We do appreciate this. This will be consumed by Absolutely. all yes. of us here. Yes. All the staff are already uh, eyeing <laughs> the food. Li they're so lining yes. up here. <laughs> thank we you. We appreciate you doing this. All right. And we'd love to have you back next year. I hope so. I hope so. Thank you. Thank you. We'll be right back with more of the Mingo Live. Más información y música coming up next. Thank you.